Hi and good evening to all of you and welcome to Chris RD Education. If you're new to this channel, um, just click uh, subscribe button and notification bell. And you can also comment in my comment section to the education that you want to, um, to learn more. Okay. So this video is about how to make a uh, realistic shallow using your Logic Pro and Equator alone. Okay. So because most of the time, with the preset of your equator, your solo strings will sound um, very dry, right? And so the tendency is for you to go to your full menu, then you will try to click to adjust the reverb, the delays, and like that. And sometimes it's having a, a very synthesized sound. It sounds like so mu too much synthesized, like this one that I'm going to... This is the solo strings, which is very dry. The tendency for you is to adjust your reverb and delays using your equator. Um, and if you do that in your equator, the sounds will be too much synthesizer. It's really, really like, it's not anymore a realistic sound. Sometimes it's good. Or like that. It's so much, there is, um, there is an unnecessary sound that you can hear if you will just adjust it in your equator, the reverb delays in some of the, the LFOs like that. That's, that's my experience, huh? And, and sometimes we really have to adjust the mid, the fr high frequency and the low frequency, but you cannot do it in your equator, right? So, uh, this is the example of the shallow that I made using the the Logic Pro and Equator. I just the solid strings in Logic Pro to sound it like a uh, real shallow. Uh, look, uh, please hear the sounds. really sounds very good and very and you can hear really the bow or you can hear the sound of the of the wood of the shallow so you don't have to make or adjust the LFO or something the river in the equator alone so we are I'm going to teach to you how to have that kind of sound okay so we're going to play again <laughs> Okay, so we're now going to begin uh, the demonstration. So before we start the demonstration, just see to it that your um, Rolly is connected to your laptop, the, your connections, and okay, all the connections are connected. All right, so the first thing to do is to open your Rolly dashboard. It's already open. See, uh, and I will not play in the keyboard. <laughs> because there is some issue in my laptop. All right, then see to it also that your Logic Pro is open and Equator is open. Actually, you can turn off your Equator now. You just have to open your Rolly dashboard and your Logic Pro. So now we are open now. Our Logic Pro is now open. So what we are going to do, it's very simple. Um, if you find this icon, this is a Logic Pro, the default is e-piano, so you go to this section under the audio FX, so you find this e-piano, which is corresponding to this kind of instrument, so uh, press in the up and down arrow button, then you go to your AU instrument, find Rolly, Equator, then Stereo. Alright, then you, the next thing to do, you will be front of the screen, so you have to move it for that your... 
um, logic will be not closed then go to the strings find the strings okay solid strings these solid strings is the default strings uh, in the equator so you just have to this uh, just have to access okay so now uh, let's have some icons double click strings have some strings so how to make this shallow so the next thing to do is to go to your audio fx here press arrow down okay then next then go to your reverb then chrome verb then stereo okay you will be planted with this kind of um reverb the default so here if you are going to play the shallow for example you're going to play the shallow for your solo part or you are the solo part in the band or you're going to cover music so you have to choose me i'm choosing the i am choosing the vocal hall okay so now you just already the vocal hall then i am increasing my wet value to 100 percent i'm increasing also the attack delay to 50 percent and delay to 3.3 so that is my settings all right so that is the way it is you just have to go to the your audio effects or sometimes if you are the the background in the band or yeah you do the background only or you're doing um uh, a music score you just have to go again to again you just have again go to this one under your equator there is a in there are the instruments are down and reverb okay stereo yeah uh, or sometimes like this only press this one these two lines i need to press the up and are down you just choose the um, chamber or concert hall depending on your taste then that is that how it is <laughs> okay for me i will be choosing voice hall okay so now if you will see here in the view then let's say show smart controls as if you will see in there here in the eq one more voice hall okay so this is now already um this is now already mixed by your logic pro so your next next thing for you to do is to play your um to play your instrument so that's how it is and also here you can if you're not um satisfied with it you can just uh adjust your low low your lows your mid to mid frequencies your high frequency to high frequency to mid frequency and one low frequency so that's it so god bless you all okay and hope you enjoyed this video